What's up guys, Freedom Firearms here. I'm gonna do this video to show you how to remove the back plate on a Glock. First thing, remove your mag if you already did it. Make sure your firearm is clear. After you do that, point the gun in a safe direction and pull the trigger. And then you're gonna wanna pull back on your slide just a little bit and then pull down on your slide lock there and push forward to remove your slide. Um, some people remove it. I remove the recoil spring and barrel just to get out of the way. It's not really in the way, but just to get it out of there. Um, so after that, you're gonna find right under here, your slide will be the bottom piece on your firing pin. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna find right under there, you'll have your spring. So you're gonna wanna take, and if your firing pin is already pushed down, you'll notice if it is right up on the black piece there, that's what you're actually pushing down. So what you're gonna do is make sure it is up away from it a little bit, but then you're gonna wanna take either a Glock push pin tool or any kind of small, anything in that general you know, size or screwdriver, anything will work. Just try not to damage you know, anything but you're gonna wanna take and push down on that spring there. And as you push down on that, you're gonna push forward on your back plate, but make sure you keep your thumb right there as you slide it off, because there is the spring that pushes both of these out so they are on the tension and pushed against your back plate. So just make sure you, know, you keep your thumb there so nothing goes flying out but that's how you remove your back plate there. And with putting it back on, pretty much what I do is I take something, the same thing I did to push it down, and you're gonna wanna push down on that black piece there. Just slide it back in that little channel so it's over that. And then you have your little spring that goes to your ejector. You're gonna wanna push down on that and then slide it in to it clicks and that's taking off your back plate and putting it back on let me know in the comments if that helped anybody and let me know if there's any videos you guys would like to see